hello 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 everyone welcome back again to my youtube channel if you are new to this channel please subscribe and if you are a returning subscriber thank you and god bless you like at this point one boza habitual boza for women of ileife those women are really trying when you have them like when you have their type in your life so ah god if all of these things we are hearing about them that if all of them are true like when you have those women in your life or in your circle you don't have problem again because they are so going to fight for you when you have like when you are hands are clean or oh, uh -huh. so my correct correct people according to what we heard allegedly women of ileife had stopped the palace of ife to shave uh all of the wrong kids hair yes so they are going to give her malakodo you know how they call her malak bikodo that one way after baby meat if you rub granite oil on top it the thing go they shine uh -huh yes so or you rub python fats you know that python fats that they normally a uh, hair when you rub it on it oh or you rub ori away <laughs> don't mind me anyway so my correct correct people it is about the sacrilege a bit taboo that uh olori ronke committed in ileife you know she had been doing so many things and be getting away with it remember there was a time she went to kabiesis uh secret chamber we are women we are not supposed to enter in fact that she's still alive is miracle people are still looking at her as if she's a walking ghost because they are like no 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 no. we are not supposed to be alive once you enter there but what do you make this woman enter there come out now only she go talk or now only she know in fact that one is just story for another day let us not go into it my correct correct people according to alleged information no, all of Ironke attacked Prince that they that got her left hand paralyzed, okay? Nobody would have known this if not that she started shouting in her chamber, from her chamber. In fact, the pain was unbearable for her. She was shouting, 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 and that was how they got to know that a way that things are not right with her and they decided to like, you know, try to find out. That was when she started confessing of trying to attack Prince that day. So, but the attack now, we don't even know whether she wanted to the innocent boy or she just wanted to keep him in a state where his mommy and his daddy will just for the rest of their lives be unhappy whenever they see him nobody knows what she wanted to do she was just shouting that she got attacked while trying to attack prince today and my correct correct people he like the women they are not the ones that you will tell something and you will tell them not to tell their husband it is not been it's not been done abby it's not like that so my correct correct people we had that when they had this they all stormed the palace they have this their gong that they will normally hit whenever drum i mean whenever there is meeting they will just go around you know their quarter not the whole like that their kindred that that their quarter they will now beat the drum ahead so whenever you hear it and you're a woman and you're at home you start running out immediately and follow them and be going around so they now went to go and gather um themselves and they stormed the palace of Ife. And when they came in, her, voila, they rushed straight to her quarters and they started banging the door before Kabiesi came out. So when Kabiesi came out and was asking, they all pleaded with him and was like, please and please and please and please, we don't want you here. Just leave us to do our work. This is women's thing. We have not come to take permission from you and we have not come to ask you if what we are about to do is right. This is our own field. This is our own battle, okay? Once your own comes you can go ahead and solve it but this one is for us okay so kabiesi was like hey well what is happening can you please just enlighten me and all of those stuff so they now told kabiesi the consequences of what olobi ronke had done by trying to attack an innocent boy a minor a toddler for that matter a way ha so then we are like they are going to shave off her hair they are going to shave everything okay they are not going to leave anyone for her they are going to shave everything okay and uh chase her out of the land that she's going to be away from their land for seven days wandering they don't want to see her anyway so in the olden days um uh if this kind of a thing happens that woman her hair should be shoved off you know and they will send her into the forest for her to wander okay if uh 
lion or anything or the animals feast on her before seven days that one is her own cup of tea then if they didn't feast on her and she comes back into the kingdom alive it means that the ancestors just wanted to like you know draw her ear so that something like that will not happen again so that is exactly what elefe women wanted to do to olori ronke yes i believe that there is no longer uh, such um so my correct correct people uh they just wanted uh, what in the be their norm okay to to happen to her because you know now that uh, we are in civilized world i'll be waiting ahead a lot of people get away with so many things okay so now they just wanted to let her know and to show her that there are consequences for every action that no sinner goes uh, scot-free so she's going to face whatsoever she do already like commit give herself so my country people, that's it as we had allegedly. I saw the alleged information on the internet space. I was like, ah, make a kukuma na me a carry and come meet on a funa domot, make on a hear as it take the bus goes. So equally drop your thoughts and your opinion about it. So do well to, you know, do that without insult to the royal throne of Ife. Yeah, what other things do you think that they should be doing, <laughs> that they should do to her? And again, do you think KBSC will agree to release her for them? Yeah, because this one that we heard that he was asking questions to what they wanted to do and all of those stuff. Do you think KBAC really like uh, that uh, KBAC will want them to do anything or, so, or such? Okay, because even the one that uh, Olorito be did by pushing down an elder, we heard that the family member came to the palace. They almost tore her apart. But KBAC um, hid her away from them. Yeah, uh, for be reasons best known to him anyway. Because he was like, he's still going to like um, allow them see her but not now because if she if he does it now that is going to bring more problem so i don't really know what do you think about all of this kindly let me know under the comment section i go see you soon in my next upload happy sunday to all of you so as we speak they are on their on their this thing on the um agreement that her hair should be shaved off yeah and um she should be sent out of the of Ileife. Yeah, they are going to send her out of Ileife so that uh, she can go there and now stay. Like she can wander for seven days in a place that is not Ileife in a in a forest. But you know there are no more forests now. But at least she's going to uh, go where there is forest. Uh -huh. So my country people, I will be ending it here. I'll see you soon in my next upload. All these things happening in the palace, they are just trying to frustrate KBAC. But one thing for sure is that one with God is majority. Let KBAC believe that he's going to he's going to defeat all of them. No matter how many ways they day, KBAC will defeat all of them. Let him have that faith and he will see himself defeating them one after the other. Thank you and God bless you.